every single one of them. Please, for God's sake, don't call this Uncle Kage's Khan. My sole contribution is I signed the contract that got you this building. The guys and ladies and gentlemen who run this convention are the ones with those yellow lanyards, so please let's hear it for that. I don't know 
who it belongs to, but I like it and I'm going to keep it. <laughs> I would like at this point to, uh, to turn the microphone over to... <laughs> Nikona! Nikona runs registration. Uh, we try every year to improve our, our registration system, batch we can think. Was it better this year than last? Yeah! We'll endeavor to make it even better next year. Because, as I say, we are volunteers, we are human, we make mistakes. The only guarantee that we give you is we will not make the same mistake twice. Nikona, what would you like to say? I'm pleased to announce we have grown a bit from last year. Last year we were at about 7,500. This year we have uh, preliminary numbers. We're looking at 8,470. I only want 8,000 registration bags. I'm sorry. We made do, and everyone got a bag, so. So just be close to Thank you, Nakona! That was sweet. Um, where's Rachel? Oh, hi! One of the hallmarks of Anthrocon is we have always, since the day of our first inception, we have been dedicated to raising money for charity. I'm now going to turn it over to Rigel, who's he has been the coordinating effort. He is the keystone to our charity efforts. Roger, please take it away. Uh, this year our charity was South Hills Pet Rescue. Uh, we raised uh, money from a wide variety of sources this year. We've tried some new things, uh, received money from new events, uh, and I'm going to try to run through as best I can here. I want Before I start, I want to thank uh, my staff, uh, my, Great staff was wonderful support for me, helping me all the way through. I uh, could, couldn't possibly do it without them. Um, as well as uh, all the people with the events that contributed money, the individual donors, uh, all our bucket brigaders. We tried something new this year and uh, put up a spreadsheet online and had people, invited people to come and sign up. And we have more bucket brigaders this year than we've ever had in any previous year, which is great. Um, let's see. Uh, the... Uh, we also had, we received money from the Angel Dragon Meet, they donated $42. Uh, the Poker Tournament brought in $1,520. The Cards Against Humanity event brought in $400. The MST3K event brought in $1,222. Uh, the, let's see, uh, the Writing Track brought in $205. The Furry Language uh, event brought in $25. Fox and Pepper show brought in $2,039. The Late Show with Booty brought in $300. Furry Furry brought in $330. The Wine Stream brought in $1,300. Furry D&D &D brought in $126. The Comedy Show, uh, in addition, above and beyond their ticket sales, brought in $4,388. <laughs> We also received uh, don individual donations from Furry Science, who provided $200. Uh, Philip Mills gave us a generous $100, as well as Mistletoe. Uh, Fumble Rob also donated $100. We appreciate that very much. Uh, our raffle this year brought in $4,539. The auction brought in $7,090. The comedy show and ticket sales brought in $4,070. They made $1,785 in merchandise sales. Uh, donations of cash uh, plus individuals totaled $2,383. Uh, the Bucket Brigade total ended up being $4,126, Ooh. a brand new record for the convention. <laughs> Thank you very much, Our event total, uh, the total of all the events, just the events that came in, was $10,597. Uh, we added in an additional 1420 that we usually bump up for t-shirt sales. We give a portion of that in. Uh, and our final total this year was $36,012.80. In case they'd like to say a few words. Who's a good puppy? Who's a good puppy? 
Who's a good boy? 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 First of all, thank you so much. My name's Stacey. I'm with South Hills Pet Rescue. We are honored to be part of this this year. This was amazing for us. So, as you heard on Friday, with actually, we were looking for a second property. So, everything from your private donations to the Bucket Brigade, that all helped tremendously. You really helped save dogs this whole weekend. Um, so, please follow us, though. Join our journey as we continue to save more dogs and grow and expand. We are on Facebook. We're on Instagram. We know that you took pictures with um, the dogs that we have. You took pictures of your of just yourself. We'd love if you would tag us so we can follow you, too. So we will continue to build our communities together. So thank you so much for your support. I think they may go to sleep for about a month. They told me last night this group really knows how to party. So yes, we, Nick and I, as you guys know, if you were here for opening ceremonies, um, our goal here today and our goal, you know, for Anthropon was to get us to a point where we could have a down payment on a new property. And I just wanted to let you guys know that we hit it. So we will be able Of course, I you know, feel like crying right now. Um, I wanted to let you guys all know, though, that I went ahead and called all the dogs at the kennel. There's about 75. And when I told them all that they're going to get to have some property to run around on and we're going to work on getting a swimming pool, they all said, you rock. <laughs> so we wanted to thank everybody involved with Anthrocon. Um, I've probably never seen such an organized uh, event in my life. So thank you. I think they all make it look like a breeze. So we all get to have a lot of fun while they all get all the stressed out parts. Um, but we wanted to thank all of you who attended. We wanted to thank everybody who supported us. Um, my husband and I will be attending next year for the fun part. So you'll probably see us again. So please come and tell us hello. Uh, you guys have all been amazing. You were all very generous. And everybody was very friendly. So this has been a very good experience for us. Um, it's our first experience at Anthrocon. But I can tell you, there will be many more. Thank you. back to that a little bit later, but before we do, um, I would like to thank, uh, we had two of the most exquisite guests of honor this year, and I very much hope that they're here, because I think I forgot to tell them they had to be in closing ceremony. Oh, 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 are they here? Uh, yep, I, I see a Dalmatian, so I think they're here. Let us welcome our first guest of honor. Who is it? Who is the first guest of honor? Who is it? Our yes, we have the most incredible guest of honor, the absolutely inimitable, the 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 the, the great, the remarkable. Oh, Ursula Vernon is here. Thank you very much, Ursula Vernon, ladies and gentlemen. You snuck up on him, sir. And you, you were talking about someone whose name you'd forgotten. It was fun. <laughs> it's not forgotten. I was just afraid you weren't here. Jonas, uh, have a seat. Yes, please, please. Uh, uh, oh, gee, Ursula, considering that this is your first time at a furry convention, uh, what did you think? You're all a bunch of weirdos. <laughs> And we're very proud of that fact. <laughs> and really so. You don't get weird like this just off the shelf. This is this is dedicated. Years into making weird and uh, I mean I help a little. <laughs> yep. I would I would dare say that some of Ursula Vernon's work may well have been the gateway drug for some people in the very fact. You can't pin this on me. <laughs> Oh, you left a paper trail, my dear. We'll talk about it. 
However, Ursula Vernon was also joined by a gentleman who is a legend. Uh, you've seen his animation that goes back years. Those of us who are our age grow up with it. The rest of you also grow up with it because you're younger than we are, and I have no idea where I'm going with that. Then Simon, ladies and gentlemen, Don Blue's greatest professional animator. Where are you, man? Thank you. You are. Um, I, I, I'm a man of few words. I just want to say thank you again for having me. Uh, you guys made it a, a very easygoing experience, um, and uh, after all this, uh, I have a feeling you may see me again. So. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, as we do, I should extend the invitation to our honored guests, Len. Next year, we, we might not be able to do the, the, the colossal room or the, or the incredible limousine and all that crap like that. But if you would like to return, we would be very happy to have you and we can, we can take care of part of that. And, and Ursula, if you would like to come back and be on staff and do what I tell you, you're welcome to come back. <laughs> <laughs> like Randy is going to let me not do it. <laughs> We would like to thank the Dorsaya regulars who for 16 years have been keeping all of you safe and secure. You make up. And for, I don't so many years we would like to thank the assistance of our, our best American Sign Language Interpreters, Vic and Lauren, who have put up with Alkali screwing with them at charity shows for at least the past five years. Thank you very much, Vic and Lauren. We love you. Yeah. And of course, we cannot thank enough the staff of the David L. Lawrence Convention Center, the staff of the Weston Convention Center Hotel, and the entire city of Pittsburgh, who was happy to turn itself furry for our weekend once again. So, I have a few people I would like to thank. And first off, I'd like to thank all the performers who dedicated their time for Anthrocon tonight, for the dance comp, for Floor Wars. Thank you all for sharing your amazing talent with everyone. Thank you to my producers who helped put those shows together so that I didn't go completely crazy. And I, there's one particular person I'd like to name. I'm sure you all love your acrylic fursuit tags and the new process for getting them. Please tell me you like the new process. Yeah. Yeah. Biz Otto. He's the one, his company cuts all of the tags for us. He does an amazing job. He works with my staff artists to make those tags. And, well, this year they had a happy accident in getting all of them done and delivered. And then he swore me because it was 150 pounds of plastic. <laughs> in like two boxes. So thank you, Fizz. And thank all of you for everything you do. We put on, you help us put on the program and get it together. And then you enjoy it. So makes part of my life easier. We have enough to money for charity this year. It's not an exhaustive list. I could go on all night long, but people have asked me specifically not to go on all night long. Uh, we would like to thank uh, the folks who, who gave charity performances, Fox and Pepper, uh, the Celestial Dragon, Chen Long, the Great Philadelphia Lawyer, the Boozy Badger, Alkali, who is, I think, throwing up backstage right now, uh, Pandas, who came out just for the day to do the charity show for us, and everybody else who raised even the smallest amount for charity, thank you very, very much on behalf of the animals, of the South Hills Pet Rescue, and of Anthrocon itself, our hats are off to you. Okay, just a uh, couple more numbers to note. Our uh, first suit parade this year had 1,000. 
980. I, I believe that uh, our cheetah, who claims he's not, uh, he's our, our social media manager, has a few numbers. He's not actually a cheetah, he's actually only 30% cheetah, the rest of him is leopard, so he is a cheetard. <laughs> times that Anthrocon was mentioned on Twitter over the past week, 13,904 tweets mentioned us. We became a trending topic for the Pittsburgh area, and Anthrocon even made Twitter moments. Wow. I run more than you. It went the other way, too. Every time we tweeted, we got a lot of retweets, and our tweets are just shared far and wide. Twitter calls it an impression. What we call it is every time one of Anthrocon's tweets scrolls across somebody's device. The number of times that that happened this past week, 1,551,000. Tweets, we answer questions, we help people with issues, but if there's something we missed or something we can do better at, we did create a survey, it's up on our website, anthrocon.org slash survey, and if you don't mind taking a few minutes to fill us out and let us know what you liked and what we can do better, we'd love to hear from you. Thank you. So, uh, yeah, just a quick question for everyone here, the same thing as ever. Did you all have fun? Yeah! That's always what I like to hear. So, I just want to give a big thanks to everyone, because we all, a lot of us, we're all working behind the scenes. So, uh, I'm just the guy who brings people together. The guys who I really want to give thanks are those who are sitting right behind everyone. So everyone can turn around and look at the people up on the risers back there. Like, uh, I'm mad at puns, okay? So you were working that up all day. Yes, I was. It was great. Okay, no, it wasn't. But anyway, <laughs> but thank you, everyone. I just want to just I'm just glad everyone had fun. So. <laughs> all right, yep, that's it. <laughs> uh, what else do we have up here for amazing people? Um, I would be remiss if we did not thank. Uh, uh, it's not an official title, however, I have started to use it, and I do not think the board of directors would disagree. I started to call Moth Monarch our artist in residence, because if you saw the sheer amount of artwork she did, those banners outside, the street banners, the welcome banner at the airport, Moth Monarch did an incredible job, all in 24 hours! because I forgot to tell her we needed the art. So thank you, Moth Monarch, my darling. And I promise, I promise, next year I will give you at least 48 hours notice for the artwork that we need. Don't double do to me. Which, Ash, hi! What? 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 Was there a steam on my Oh, hi, Talon! What? <clears throat> uh, you see, one of the problems with running a convention is sometimes you forget to do... There's always something that's overlooked, like the list of things you're supposed to discuss at closing ceremonies. So we're winging it right now, we're doing our damnedest. It was... Oh, yes, 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 uh, we, we happen to have here, years and years ago, back in the Stone Age, before most of you were even conceived, and the wheel had not yet been invented, uh, and they were actually, they, they had square wheels in those days, and it was very difficult, humanity was not proceeding at the pace it should have. Uh, we had some directors, 
who served for many, many years and then wisely got the hell out while they could. <laughs> Benny and Sue are down here in the front. Uh, that is Benny and Susan Deere, or at least Benny. Uh, our former directors came back to laugh at us because we are these first ladies and they don't. Benny and Sue, thank you very much. Oh, oh, um... Our theme next year, and next year's dates, uh, correct me, gentlemen, if I'm incorrect, are uh, July 4th through, he's looking up, July 4th through 8th, 7th, July 4th through 7th, 2019, Anthro Khan will be back, we'll be back here in this exact same location with every single hotel with the addition of one more, the absolutely coincidentally named AC Hotel. like to do. Our darling friend KP, who has been with us for damn near 20 years, simply could not join us this year, but that does not mean he was not an influence on Anthrocon 2018. KP, we could not do it without you. We very much hope to see you next year, my friend. Let's hear it for you. Um, a tiny reminder from the Dorsai regulars and from the board of directors of Anthrocon and from their chairman. Remember, we pride ourselves on being good guests. The city of Pittsburgh adores us. We like to keep it that way. We would like you to have fun on this, the last night of celebrations of Anthrocon 2018. But remember, you are still bound by our standards of conduct. Let's not go too crazy, okay? <coughs> Have fun, but make sure Pittsburgh still loves us in the morning, okay? <laughs> put the fire alarm at the Western last night has not yet been identified. It, however, however, I am willing to forgive that person on one condition. And one condition only. The South Hills Pet Rescue has been hoping to raise $80,000 to purchase the land that they need to expand. Anthrocon, because of your generosity, has raised $36,012, which is a great start. If we can make that $80,000, i will let that person live. <laughs> So the only thing I'm asking is, as we close the convention this year, we've got all this space on the stage in front. If you would like to help us get closer to that $80,000, let's see how close we can get, not only to help the South Hills Pet Rescue, but to prevent the murder of an otherwise innocent individual. <laughs> Is that a deal? He's not kidding, folks. Oh, no. They've known me for 20 years. They know I'm not kidding. So, ladies and gentlemen, what's left in your pockets, your wallets, if you could leave it on the stage. In the meantime, I officially declare Anthrocon 2018. Oh, no!
history for raising $80,000 for the South Hills Pet Rescue, shall we, ladies and gentlemen? Thank you all very much to the seed in 2019 for so specific. Incidentally, you notice for the staff, you're on the clock, get back to work.